Like Paul, obedience plays an integral part in God's love. So both John and Paul talk about obedience. John chapter 10 verse 17. John 10 verse 17. Right. The Father loves me because I lay down my life in order to take it up again. No one takes it from me. I lay it down of my own free will. And as I have the power to lay it down, so I have the power to take it up again. And this is the command I have received from my Father. So what do we see? Jesus talking about the command. Keep in mind, uh, John is looking at the love of God, God's love, of course, through Jesus. The Father loves me because I lay down my life in order to take it up again. If you keep my commandment, you will remain in my love, just as I have kept my Father's commandment and remain in His love. That is John chapter 15 verse 10. The latter part is John 15 verse 10 if you keep my commandments you will remain in my love so that is just to underscore the whole theme of obedience that according to Paul and John obedience is in an integral part in God's love thus through obedience the son reveals how much God loves us Jesus accepts his suffering obediently John 14 31 but the world must recognize that I love the father and I act just as the father commanded me I shall no longer be with you because the prince of this world is on his way he has no power over me but the world must recognize that I love the Father and I act just as the Father commands me. John chapter 14 verse 31. So in making up that summary we see Paul and John sharing the same theme of the obedience. We have to ask ourselves, how do we put that whole aspect of obedience in our lives? Are we obedient to the will of God? Are we obedient to the vows that we take? What part, what is the significance of obedience in our mind? When we hear the word obedience, what really comes to mind? See, very often we don't even think about obedience. Eh? People don't even follow that. But according to Jesus, He came to fulfill the will of the Father and He did it in total obedience, which is a central theme in the love of God. And so both Paul and, and John talk about obedience. Therefore, let us today as continue to examine this whole theme of obedience as it is in respect to God's love. And tomorrow we continue with this theme of the love of Almighty God in the New Testament.